Morning Message by Dr. Jeffrey Barkey. Talk a little bit about it. Morning Message. It's a book I've been working on for the past year. It's filled with information about how to get healthy, um, how to dispel the myths that we've been told about what healthy is. Uh, Kirk Cameron wrote a foreword for me. So did Prager Hughes, Will Witt. In addition, the Surgeon General of the state of Florida, Dr. Joe Latipo, was kind enough to write a forward for me as well. Book just came out. You can get it on morningmessage.com, morningmessage.com. Hmm. And I'm really proud of it. And it's a, it's a lot of fun to have this out there now. Congratulations to you, by the way, Doc. Uh, this is awesome. Um, and a lot of our listeners, a lot of people just everywhere, look forward to your morning message every single morning. You know, you talked about a couple things this week that I, I, I really want to get into. I also want to talk to you about the China pneumonia. Um, but, you know, China. before we get into the pneumonia talk um, that might or may not pose uh, a risk to Americans here. But Skip you talked point. about something that I, I thought was really great is to get outside. Now, not everyone is as you know, has the opportunity to look at that beautiful Pacific Ocean that you did this week. And you do probably every day. But talk about getting outside and why that is so important for your soul, your mental health, uh, wellness, and your, your body overall. Well, it's the way we used to roll 100 years ago. We wouldn't all sit inside in front of a computer screen all day long. We would be doing work outside. We'd be outside all the time. Our skin, our largest organ in our body, is in effect a solar panel for our body. And we need to expose the sun to our skin as much as possible, not just our face and arms. When I go outside, if the weather's nice enough, I take my shirt off and get as much sun exposure area as I can. The sun is so healthy for us. It converts cholesterol into vitamin D, which, by the way, another reason why we shouldn't aggressively lower cholesterol, because almost everybody I see that's on a statin with their low cholesterol has low testosterone if they're a man, has estrogen problems if they're a woman, and low vitamin D. Cholesterol is good. Yep, I said it. I said it out loud. It's not cholesterol that causes heart disease. It's inflammation and metabolic dysfunction. Hmm. That's what we should be measuring. That's what we should be treating. So get outside. Early morning sunshine is the best without glasses on so that sun can get into the back of your eyes, stimulate serotonin and melatonin in your body, it's one of the greatest ways to get good sleep is morning sunshine. So get out there, get some sun. No, I don't want you to get burnt. I don't want you to get skin cancer. But if you work your way up to about at least 30 minutes of sunshine a day, it will make you a healthier person.